Hello everyone and welcome back to Legend of Mana where we have a ton of artifacts which means a lot of new places to open up. Which means let's take Lisa with us. Even though I don't think she got any experience last time. Um, do I need to go down here first? I know there's a thing. Yeah, the orchard. This opens up eventually. There's like a lot of things that you can do like on the homestead. Eventually. I don't remember how to unlock any of these things, so... Hopefully we'll just, uh, we'll just figure it out as we go. Alright, actually, the only one I know what it does is... Oh, the wheel and the stone eye. Um... I kind of want to do the trembling spoon. I don't remember that one. Uh, I'd still like to know what is up with this space. I, I normally like, like to figure things out on my own. But if anyone can tell me why that space is off limits, I would love to hear it. Why does this open up? Is this actually evil? I feel like a lot of them seem evil, and then it's like, oh, it's just a town. Man, I don't remember that place. The Oh, it's the literal underworld. Okay, this is probably fine. This is why we got Lisa to go come with us. So a lot of times the quest doesn't start until you go into the area. I actually, oh, you know what? Hold on. My, my memory was just jogged, potentially incorrectly. Uh, but there might be another quest here that, like, if I don't do it now, it's gone forever. So, I'm gonna, let's, let's talk around here first. I know, I, like, this place was so riveting last time we were here. I could, I could definitely be misremembering. Um, we're good. Could be anybody. It could be anybody. I don't remember. I just remember... For some reason, I have this memory of me kind of being mad at myself for not coming back here after finishing... How's everything going with you? Uh, fine, I guess. Anything... Yeah, you say the same thing. Okay. Yeah, I still feel like the character sprites with everything else is like a bit jarring. Oh, there you are. Okay. You do something. If you could go to the underworld alive, would you? Uh, sure. You go there in those spirits and you may become one of them. Just be aware of that. Oh. I feel like that's important. I don't remember how or why. About you. Oh, hello. I'm Monique, the lamp maker. Yeah, I know. I sold a bunch of your lamps for you. Uh, it was really no big deal. I, I mean, I did most of the work. It's fine. It's, f it's in true hero fashion. What about you? Do you have anything? The cows in your mind? Yeah. Duh. Where else would the cow be? Okay. Did I need to do that? I don't remember. Should have taken something for my uh for my cough beforehand. I've I'm getting sick, I can tell, so that's why I'm trying to try to get these videos in uh in time so I can give myself a little bit of a I'm scared of ghosts. Oh, it's fine. I want to go home. Um, can I not bring you here? Well, that's a problem. Please tell me I get someone inside once I go in. Anyway, as I was saying, back to home because we don't really need... Lisa, or anybody, we got this. 
The other option I could do... I could just plop everything down. I think I used to do that. I don't think the- I don't think either one will go to the underworld. For some reason I was thinking like eventually they would give in and just go. But that is seeming to not be the case. Cause they're chickens. Yeah, no, we're fine. We're fine. This is all fine. Just gonna casually stroll through the underworld as one does. Oh, hello. One warrior I shall test your strength. Whoa! The fallen emperor. I don't remember this at all. Uh oh. Oh, who are you? Have you awakened? I'm Lark, Dragoon or Draconis. Uh, draw what now? A Dragoon, a knight who serves a dragon. If you want to know more, come with me to the depths of this place. Um, yeah, sure, whatever. I'm here now. I shall descend into the belly of the earth. Go at your own pace and I shall follow. Yes! Alright, so that's why I had to get rid of Lisa. Oh, hello. Hey, newly dead, watch out for that guy. Ha 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 Where's Shadows? See, Shadow Tadpoles. I feel like I remember getting lost here. It's like a hazy memory. Oh, boy. Take that candy. Oh, and my money. Gonna need that. Get off my experience. Oh, chocolate. I like that they incorporated, like, the chocolate and the candy from previous Mana games. Although, now they're just drops. What did I get? Odd meat. Delicious, by the way. So we robbed the cafeteria. Uh, I don't really know how we, where we go from here. Can I just get some? Ex I just need two experience points. That. All right, fine. This way. Uh, hold on. All right, second level. Okay, we're, we're moving. To the south or, or this way. Baptismal. Oh, I think I need to come here. Hey, I don't watch out for that. Uh, yeah, you said that. Yeah. I need you to pour some flames over my companion here. No way, Jose. Nobody gets the baptismal flame without all Bond's permission. Who is Olban? Oh crap. Is Olban back this way? Cause I do <sighs> This is a place where you can just like end up going around in circles if you don't go the right way. Alright, let's check out the cafeteria. Oop, facing the- how did that happen? I didn't- I didn't even have my hand on the D-pad. Again, I- I've been facing that way the whole time. I don't need candy or chocolate. I need two experience points. You're not here. I gotta fight these guys again. Die? Charge up time though. Well, I'll have some extra money. Ooh, he gave me an item this time. Alright, do I have to go back further? Or do I keep going and then backtrack? Uh huh. 
Are there any other choices I made? Yeah, right off the bat, I'm pretty sure... I had no choice in the matter. Oh, other fun thing. You can't leave once you start here. And I feel like a lot of quests are like that. And I think this that's one reason this never ended up being like a personal favorite game of mine. Even though I liked playing through it well enough. But it's never a personal favorite. And I think it's partly because so many dungeons lock you in and I just get like oddly claustrophobic <laughs> when I can't leave areas like it it really I feel stuck and it's like well but what if you know what if I get stuck and I can't proceed and I'm just doomed forever and I have to start the game over so then I just don't play it which makes no sense hmm. I suppose we'd better see Oban yeah he is aware directions would be super helpful by the way uh, Oban you can only go, you can go out if you wish, but no door will open for you. you must put to Orban first, so you'll be unable to get around. Or near here, he has a wisdom and the custodian of the departed souls. He keeps the dead from getting out of hand. Alright, he's near here. Hey, there we go. Uh, Orban. Name Orban, keeper of the underworld. Lark, dragoon of Draconis. Why do you always bother me with uninvited guests? They all become shadows, you know. As a dragoon, I merely follow the will of my master. Hmm, this time you've brought quite a lively one. So would Draconis' evil plan succeed now? I'd love to help out, but if the posi right position opened up... If you mean what you say, then give permission to receive the baptism of flame. But if those words were meant to insult my master... Hmm, permission granted. She may receive the baptism of flame. A shadow will guide you. The underworld is a vast place, but I can help you get around. Where to? Uh, baptismal chamber. Oh, I can leave. Once the baptism is done, the closed doors will open. I ask the shadows in the chamber to perform the ritual. Yeah, we're, we're right there. You. Uh, so what's on your mind? We have permission to perform the baptismal flame. Here you go, Radio. Got it. Now you can go to the bottom levels. Let's go. My master awaits. So I feel like this is another quest chain. Although I don't remember this one. I don't know that I've ever finished it. I don't think I've done all the endings. I think the ones I remember most involve Pearl. Wait, where? Where am I? Uh, hello? Uh, this isn't the baptism chamber. Third level? Alright, fine. It's fine. Just keep going down. Uh, hello. Do any of you drop experience? I could really use Boulder Dash. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh. Oh! Level up. Oh, there we go. 110 lucre. Level up. Finally. Probably gonna regret this at saying this at some point, but for some reason, I remember this game being much harder. Like, enemies dealing more damage, I think, is the big thing. Now, let's just see if you are worthy enough to serve my master. Are you ready? Uh, sure. Here we go. Shrine of Silence. Oh, uh, hello. Rising Eagle. No! You fool. Oh, it still hit him. Oh, he's, he's the face now. Right? Ooh. No! Where is he? Oh, did that, that reset my bar? I'm pretty sure. 
Oh, that's a sneaky move. Okay, so now he's gonna be... Okay. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, cool. Stood out of the way. Oh, slippery. Right, over here seems safe. Maybe I come over here. Yeah, there we go. Just get him focused on... I don't think he... Does he get stunned? That would be... Oh, there we go. Oh, he's three. He's three people now. That missed horribly. So, you basically have two different types of attacks. You have your fast attack, and then a slower, stronger attack. Ooh, he got sent flying. You know what? I'll take uh, this Draconis guy. Oh, 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 what is this? No, stay away. Oh, oh, what? No! Oh, now I'm moving backwards. It's alright. Earthbound has trained me for this very moment. Stop it! What? Ow! Oh, come on. Lark, if that really is your name. What kind of name is that? No, stop it. Okay, that missed, that missed, that missed. Just need to, need to get a stun in. Okay, so what is he, uh... Oh, they fake you out! Some of them didn't even do things. Ooh, that's sneaky. Okay, who, which of you is actually gonna- Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, that sucked. Oh, I forgot, if we stand close together, we get, uh, health back. Ooh. Stay away. Come on, this is- This is doable. Lark! Stun him! Oh my god, you get, like, Two hits in. Oh, come on. Oh. Alright. It's alright. He doesn't seem bothered by it at all. Oh, there we go. Alright. Piece of cake. As I was saying. Oh, level up. Double level up. That's when you know, like, oh, this was probably a higher level place than you should have been. That's fine. Incredible. My master will be most pleased. Pulpit of Eternal Flame. The master approaches. Be ready to receive him. Lord Draconis. So, Lark, you finally found someone capable of defeating Hidodama. Yes, my lord. Forgive me, great warrior. I am not one for pleasantries. My name is Draconis. I summoned you here for a reason. I want you to return the magical powers that were stolen from me by three dragons. Why? Long ago, before I was cast down here, I was the Emperor of Dragons. But three of my jealous kin stole my powers. I have wandered the underworld in this weakened form ever since. Long have I awaited the arrival of one strong enough to avenge me. The Master asked that you defeat the three dragons who wronged him. You have no choice but to cooperate. You see, if you let yourself remain as a half-spirit, you will eventually turn to nothingness. I could not stand letting so capable a warrior fade away. If you defeat the three dragons, I will return you to your previous form. Well, sounds like I'm stuck. Alright, let's do it. I'm pretty sure that triggered a flag. I'm indebted to you, mighty warrior. The master told me to give you a gift as proof of our contract. Skull Lantern, alright. I hope you are ready. We are off to hunt the dragons of knowledge. They think they keep order in the world, but we need not be subjected to their rule. If what I am doing does not sit well with you, you are free to do as you will. 
but do not forget this is an important opportunity to test your powers. Not to mention you'll die otherwise. Kind of important to point out there. The Fallen Emperor. Yeah, he does not seem like a good guy. Uh, and that he's going to let us die if we don't do what he says, so... I don't believe we're, like, permanently stuck on that track. Which is weird. You'd think they'd have to resolve the whole, yeah, you're going to fade away into nothingness after uh, a hot minute here. No, apparently not an issue. Uh, I'm pretty sure Draconis does not have a pure heart, just, just in case you were wondering. Still don't have the orchard yet. All right. cannot escape your destiny. I'm gonna try. Although now it does make more sense that Bud and Lisa can't go with you. Uh, sure. What else can we put down? How about the, uh, the stone statue one? I believe that one has a save point in it. Or why can't I do that one in the corner? Weird. I can't remember if the game will let you like screw yourself over. Like in the sense that you put too many things down and then you can't put down something you need. I don't remember if the game will let you do that. I'm hoping not. Mm, the scouts ain't back yet. Could the fairies have wiped them out? Halt! That means ye, stranger. What be the password? What? Aye, very good. Captain, our mate has arrived. That ain't no mate. One look will tell you that. But you got the password correct. Yar, shut your beak. Get back to the ship before those fairies find us. Follow the penguins. The Gorgon Eye, yeah. This is another one I feel like I did later on like my most of my playthroughs. Alright. I'm just gonna mop up the experience here. You don't need it. I can't remember if I get healed between battles or not. You know, one thing I've never tried in this game is a, like a true magic build. Really, I, I don't think I've tried much beyond swords. It's also probably faster than I normally move through the game, which is weird. Because I think I would just, like, stop to grind. <laughs> Even though, so far, really not finding it necessary. Like, I think our levels have been pretty good. I think it's going to be hard. I'm, like, oh, oh, the penguins got turned to stone. That's why it's the Gorgon Eye. Got fish meat. Oh, no, I need to go this way. Follow the penguin statues. Right? I think that's the way of it. That's like another neat thing. A lot of these maps are used multiple times for different quests, depending on which ones you decide to do. Which you get, like, think how early we are into this game and how many choices I've had to make so far.
Like, I don't know how meaningful they are, but it is interesting that it lets your journey be quite different. Excuse me, youngin. Hello, I'm a turtle. I have a favor to ask you. Could you stand still right there for me? Sure. Spin, spin, spin. I spin around. That's better. Thank you, youngin. The pirates did this to me. They trampled over me on the way to look for the fairy treasure. By the way, can you see the fairies here? Uh... No, are you okay? The fairies here only show themselves to those who threaten them. If you cannot see them, it means they trust you. I'll cast a spell so you will be able to see them. Turtle, 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 -y da. Hey, there's fairies. Can I save here? Oh, I can. All right, cool. I'm actually going to call it an episode here. I know, uh, middle of a dungeon, not great, but, uh, didn't want to, didn't want to sit there for five minutes doing nothing, but also didn't quite have enough time to, to finish this dungeon. So we'll, we'll call it there. We'll pick this up in the next one. Let me know in the comments if, uh, you're enjoying this. Uh, I think this is probably the last episode I'm going to do for the day. So, uh, let me, let me know in the comments if you're enjoying this, if you're looking forward to it and want to, want to see more, that would be really helpful. Thank you. Uh, as always, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you next time.